Good morning everyone, my name is Christian from Two Headed Wolf Gaming and welcome back to Graveyard Keeper. Now today I'm going to start the episode by picking up those healing potions and I think it's about time we go and talk to the witch, heal her up and see what she, what we can do from there. I remember that last time, let's see. Aphorism about evil. Uh, did we need to make a bunch of these for the donkey? Let's see. Create and send anti-money aphorism via the contraband box. Okay, well, let's make one of these and send it away for the donkey. And go, let's see, where did we leave? Did we leave somewhere the healing potions? We probably did, didn't we? Let's go here. Uh, let's throw this inside. And check out the area for wherever you, we might have left the healing potions. And then we'll take a trip through the swamp. This is red wine. More apples. A B honey, we have fish. We should take some of this food with us. Maybe even make some dough and make back some bread for us. Do I wanna clear my inventory even more? Maybe with a few sticks. Yeah, let's throw in some planks. So yeah, let's start here. Let's go and check out what the what we can do with the witch. We'll be back until tomorrow evening when the donkey comes around. We can even leave here in the box for the donkey some some of these, right? We, oh, we can send aphorism. Let's also send the five face. We'll use the rest. We'll use the rest to do some research, as we could use a few extra blue points. Now it's very windy on this day. Uh, for us, it actually in real life started snowing today. It has been pretty cold in the last few days, now it's November. Like, I had colleagues at work making fun uh, that... Uh, it's a bit early for snow, usually uh, snow comes in uh, in March, which has been happening for the past years. Okay. The witch is not around. Let's collect some of these mushrooms. Maybe we can do something with them. Maybe even this hiccup grass, we could uh, research it. See if we can decompose it in any kind of properties. Probably in the next episode, we should also think about a way of improving our laboratory, right? Underneath the church, I try to get all those workshops in. And we'll do all these while waiting around. Okay, so the donkey came around, but it didn't show us that it gave us a body. Yeah, they just uh, just retook the contraband, and we received new notes for. It. We'll take a tree with us as well, I guess. I wonder if we need to wait any longer for the witch. Is the witch coming out or on different days? No. So grow a silver star pumpkin and help the witch restore her memory. Okay, here she is. Let's give her a health potion. Hmm, looks good. Let's try it. Oh, now I remember. I'm Clodo. 
and I remember where I hid my cauldron. Okay, now I'm back, so what do you need from Old Cloto? I got some good stuff, you know. Uh, you won't find potions this good anywhere these days. Let's see, I need your help. I need you to help the merchant. He told me he knew you well. He used to buy love potions from you with his friend, the priest. Oh, I remember. They, they were so sweet. But they were brothers, as I recall. So how can I help him? He ate some hiccup grass and lost his sense of taste. He thinks he's cursed. Sounds like a curse laid on him by another witch, so it would be unprofessional of me to help him. In the old times we used to help out in situations like this, but then the whole market collapsed. Now it's forbidden. Only the witch who placed the curse on him can craft the potions to remove it, so there's no cure for him? Let me see. I've told you the basics, and you're no witcher. <laughs> there's a fancy word for what you are. Chemist. Alchemist, right. So you can craft a potion for him and I'll tell you the recipe. Just put salt and health solution together. Thank you. Okay, we can now create spices. Let's see, I need your help. Okay. And we can buy from her all types of recipes and powders and... Pretty soon we'll unlock this one as well. Okay. Well, I'm not sure where we should be producing some more of those alchemy ingredients, except for going through the dungeon. But we'll check it out. Okay, well, let's see. What's next for us? Oh, there's nothing here, is it? Known NPCs. Receive the note the day after the donkey arrives. Okay, is there anybody? No, not yet. I guess for the moment I would like some more blue points. So, well, how do we want to do this? I think I want to look for anything that we could research that would give us blue points. I'm a bit of a completionist. So what I think I will do at some point will be to go and research everything. There's nothing blue here. Let's finish constructing these parts. And here we have some jewelry that we could sell. A few parts. What about here? Nope, same idea. Red and green. So maybe underground we would be able to find some. Here we'll throw these apples. Oh no, we already gave them away. Let's see, what do we do here? Hemp, bat wings, everything else we studied already. We could work on a few soft covers or other stuff like that. But it doesn't seem useful for me. Do I want to study the pen and ink? Uh, 
Let's see, decompose that or that. Here is combining different items. Like we could spices, salt and health solution. Zombie alchemy decomposer or a hand mixer. Is this a hand mixer? It is a hand mixer. Okay, we'll have to see. Take the note from the contraband box. Health powder. What do we mix health powder to make that health potion with? Water? Could be water. Huh. Okay, what do we have here? So... We don't have a lot of white points. But this is like what? 2% per white? I think it was. Oh, now we don't have enough face anymore. So maybe we'll just take it and bury it and go from there. Let's see, what is the note here? Revolutionary message number two, a pile of components. Let's use this opportunity to dig this site. A burial certificate for us to go ahead and sell. Is there anything else to research? No, not even here. I guess we were going for upgrading the church as well. Shall I do candelabra level 2? I think the answer to that is yes, but maybe put it instead of the candelabra level 1. Here we have a few places where we could add some of these. Do you think that anything else fits there? Let's see, wall candelabra 1, yeah it goes, 1 or 2. Let's one add the two ones. Okay. So now we're at 31. Yeah, we could add a few more. Hmm. Then that's what we shall do. We shall use some of the food that we have. And we're gonna make more metal parts. Let's start by breaking down iron ores here. After that, we're going to throw the iron ores into the oven. And after that is done, we're gonna start making some more iron parts. Let's see, with you that's just enough let's see what did the donkey say now donkeys of all countries unite one ecopod he liked you your aphorism very much so we have decided to adopt them as the constitution of the coming worldwide donkey socialistic republic Two, after consuming the faith, everyday donkeys became greatly inspired, even believing that all donkeys are equal. We have had to remind them with our hooves that some donkeys are more equals than others. Thus, you have passed the second stage of earning the approval of the yeah, socialist donkey, whatever. 
Keep going, we need donkey combat equipment in the contraband box. Your task is to assemble and to deliver battle horseshoes and iron unicorns and magic pumpkin too. Once we can exchange for the luxurious carriage of the royal veterinarian. veterinarian. At midnight his carriage will turn back into a pumpkin and our master will look like a fool in front of the whole royal court. Let's cross our tails. Hmm, I don't know how to make donkey gear or how to enchant pumpkins. Though I know people who can. Kreswold and Ploto. Okay. We gain writer of the revolution. So let's continue making iron parts. We should probably be making even more, right? Like or more okay good should be an about enough for everything in the church I would imagine Pick up grass, let's throw that in. And maybe the revolutionary message too. At this point I think we have what we need. Let's see. Battles, horseshoes, iron unicorn horns and some magic pumpkins. Who knew that when we started building this graveyard, we would become uh, associated with donkey revolutionaries. But I guess there's a first time for everything. Trade license, yeah, we need that 50 silver. Where are we at? 20 silver. Okay. Here we have another prayer for story and faith. A stained glass window, we will need gold jewelry, we'll see about that. Let's make another wall candelabra. Let's remove these two. As soon as these are dismantled, we can push and put in the other candelabras, the level 2 ones. We are now at 35 church quality. That is awesome. Let's see, what do we need here? Do we have... For Alchemy Workbench 2, we just need the steel parts, because the rest is researched already. So if we're going to smithing, steel parts require us to go 200 red points and 20 blue points. That is pretty good. Some steel tools would be handy as well. A water pump. We could go and place some of the zombies in these other areas as well. Okay, so we're really missing blue points. Let's see. I have a church workbench. This is number one. A desk. A study table. A hand mixer. And this is an alchemy workbench. Okay. Then let's go and see what else are we missing here. Alchemy meal, which we need two polished bricks of stone and some wooden planks. 
distillation cube, which we require normal stone for. Church workbench, we have alchemy rack, well, we have the scroll shelf. So I'll take six planks, two polished bricks of stone, and some more normal stone. Here we go. Um, I'm gonna go here. Then we're going for two polished stone. We need, let's see, we're gonna take 20. And we need some polished stone, which we don't seem to. Oh no, we do have. And then let us go here, get this polished stone. Let's take some of some water as well. Because I believe that's how we can mix those potions together. I would like us, let's see, can I throw anything in here? Not yet. Okay, so here we are and we're going to start with the alchemy meal. Which doesn't fit there, either here. Okay, well, I'll place it. I'll place it like so. And then the distillation cube. Hmm, where should I? Placing here. Let's do that. Okay. Now let's construct them. And see what's what. Okay, we can decompose this into different parts. Okay. And here in the distillation cube, we will need to sleep soon. Pick this, oh, so this decomposes into something else as well as that one. Let's try to mix water with, not with blood, chaos solution, no. Then I want our first ingredient to be health powder with, see, with water, craft. Blood goo, okay. That's not exactly what I was looking for. Maybe with blood? That's zombie juice. So, health powder with blood. Does it say zombie juice if I do this? No, no, it shows us already. Health solution. What else could work with that? Chaos solution? With health solution? No. That doesn't seem right. At least now we know how to make more zombies. That's a thing. Okay, well this one is pretty bad, I guess we're not gonna worry too much, I'm gonna go rest, 
have a sip of tea too. To try to keep my voice up, as you can hear, my, my voice is still not doing too well. But it's not, not doing too bad either. I can't really complain. Okay, I am so refreshed. Good for you. So now, let's think about what we're going to do. With this one, I'm just gonna do some of this work. Let's see. I remove some of these. Okay, so that was a bad one. We can try to bring in maybe a better one. I think that that is a thing. For example, I can put in one like this. And now it has seven white pearls. Mm, how far is Sunday? Very far. So we're gonna take this and we're gonna bury it. And when Sunday comes and we have enough faith, I think I'll dig it up. In order for us to have a helper. Okay, maybe we'll remove this one and put another one here. I think that's fine. Okay, that should stop uh, the process of decaying. Uh, what else should we be doing now? Well, let's go underground. Let's start working on a few potions. Because we can and we should, we probably should as well. Let's see, does it give us, the thing is, does it give us blue points? Uh, life powder there. These did not offer us blue points. Health solution. How can I make a health solution? Health powder mixed with chaos solution gave us a health point. Okay. Well, let's try something uh, different. On this one, what do we do if we are working on brain? That gave us a life solution. Okay, let's try something else. One of these. Okay, that's a different solution. Maybe bat wings. So that's Kia's solution. Uh, let's throw everything we have in this. Even the heal potion. I'm gonna throw in the ink. Water, because we do need it. Slowing solution, chaos solution. We could research a few of this, let's see, where was it? 
Okay, it was... But let's start with this one. Apparently we just need science. Anything that doesn't consume faith is going to be really useful for knowledge. So let's continue doing this for as much as we can. Maybe even rest a bit, come back. Huh. Well, we could have done this a long time ago. It's just that we... It wasn't the right moment, let's put it that way. Okay. Awesome. Not everything offers us too many points from what I see. But the cost is so small, it doesn't even matter. Okay, let's throw some of these here. At this point I would like some wine and then we'll check that what the donkey brought us. Yeah, let's have one wine because it provides us with 60 energy. That should be plenty for what we need. Pum, pum. Music's still very, very fun. Okay, let's try to do this. And for a while, let's leave it like that. I am curious if we go here to alchemy. Let's see. This, the glue injection would give us plus one white. Okay. Let's try this embalming liquid. Let's see if it works for us. Like, do we need a special building? We have a mortuary rack and we have an embalming table. Here, we have to pick a resource. So somehow, we will have to create something which helps us here. Doesn't really show us who, which does what. Here, you know, health potion, zombie, juice, toxic death, acceleration, slowing powder. If we go with slowing powder and water, goo of acceleration. Slowing powder and blood. Goo of health. Okay. Can we combine this goo of whatever with something else? Maybe it's at Alchemy Bench level 2. Anything is a possibility. But I think I'll just cut it here. I put a cut in the episode and I'll try to get some, a bit more knowledge on alchemy and how I could make some glue to go around. Just going to check this out. Like, I feel 
it might require us some alchemy workbench level 2 so I'll probably build that first and then go then go for this or maybe here is it here it is here we need a balsamic solution a balsamic solution and conical flasks for well for all of these okay let's start by putting a cut into this episode and i'll see you tomorrow where we continue the exploration of alchemy and yeah let's see what all of this has to offer for us as an advantage as for the moment i thank you very much for watching i hope you have enjoyed it and i'll see you guys next time have a wonderful day everyone